Since the dawn of time, hunters have challenged their skills and bravery by doing battle with a giant Russian boar. From the rugged mountain peaks to the depths of the great northern forest, hunters have proven their courage and heart through mortal combat with this savage beast of the north. Fall is my favorite time to be in the great northern forest. Hello, this is Greg Johnson from Bear Mountain Lodge. My friends call me the Moose Man, and I'd like to invite you to explore the great northern forest and discover a beast unlike any you've ever seen before. Each year, as the spinning of the earth creates the autumn equinox, the world changes before your very eyes. Cold Arctic air racing down from the north has started the annual ritual where the primordial beasts enter the autumn rut. Awaken the ancient hunter and send forth the beast lair that resides deep inside each and every one of us. This is one experience you will not want to miss. Giant Russian boar and the autumn rut. As the dog days of summer slide on by, the Russian boar begins his battle to establish dominance within the herd so he may carry forth his ancient DNA bloodline dating back to the dawn of time. The first of the season, there is a lot of sparring and jousting going on between the boars, with even the young trophy class boars testing their skills in battle. But as the cool nights and the brisk days paint the forest with bright fire red leaves, the conflict between the alphas intensifies, and the attitude of the dominant boars change, and they become extremely unpredictable and territorial. Many of the big alphas will stake out their own turf, Basically, these are their lairs within the forest. Here, they'll defend their turf. These are the breeding grounds. They are maintained by the alpha boars, the herd boars, the ones that do the breeding of the receptive sows and the young unbred females, the ones called gilts. Of course, there are rogue boars crewing seen around the forest trails trying to jump in on a harem. And you never know when you might encounter one of these boars searching for a quick opportunity to breed. They're ready to breed, or they're ready to fight. If you trespass into one of the lairs of one of the dominant alpha boars, you just might never know what's going to happen. I've seen the beasts flee at the first sign of human predators, and then I've seen them charge. Many of the dominant beasts breed all night, and they sleep or pass out, if you will, during the day. So it's not uncommon to be following a twisty, turning game trail right into the darkest parts of the forest and come on upon a big boar stretched out on the ground. I've actually walked up onto a big boar thinking that this one had died in mortal combat with another alpha. And then, to my surprise and all those around me, that big boar transformed into a savage, surly beast. Boy, that was a real excitement. Things really began to happen as that 400-pound beast of prey came alive right before my eyes, or should I say, right at my feet. Definitely a heart pounder. Oh, man. Well, sometimes they jump up and flee, as I mentioned earlier. Other times they charge, and then again, they may just bluff charge you. A bluff charge is intimidating, as the boar will pop his cutters with his wetters, the cutters being the lower tusks. And those are the ones that develop the razor sharp's edge. The popping of the jaw allows the wetter, the upper tusk, to sharpen the lower tusk. And this transformed the cutters into a saber with razor sharp edges made for offense and defense. The boar may continue popping his cutters and pawing the ground. This is a sure sign of aggression. They don't just do that for human predators, but also among themselves. When two big alpha boars come together, you may witness a battle royale. I'm asked all the time, how dangerous are they? First off, they're just not the lions of Africa, a predator that will hunt you down, kill you, and eat you. They're more like the Cape Buffalo, the world's most dangerous game animal. If you hunt them, they just might hunt you back. There are several different ways to hunt the wild boar. You don't have to go head to head with them. You can post up an ambush. We've got three blinds strategically located throughout the hunting grounds. This makes for a safe, secure hunt, so you won't be going face to face with one of these big brutes. Again, many different techniques, still hunting, ambush, elevated stands, so we can set the hunt up so you can really enjoy the autumn rut. 
Now what I'd like you to do is go down below and click on the link. That'll take you over to a special packages that I've prepared for the autumn rut. So you can come up, stay at Bear Mountain Lodge for free, and hunt Russian boar. Go ahead, check it out, click on the link below, and then that'll transfer you over to the rates and options. When you click the link, you'll be taken to a web page where you'll be able to see a free video that reveals how to select the right package for you. So go ahead and click the link.